Well, it's that time of year again when we are on holiday and rather than give up our routine, our Pilates routine, I just thought I would give you a few Pilates uh, sessions, just 10 minutes long to do on your holidays. I'm Louise from Studio 44 Pilates, so let's get going. So we're going to lie down on the mat and set ourselves up in our neutral position. Just relaxing the shoulders, finding that neutral, having those heels underneath the knees and just focusing in on your breathing. So just focus on your breathing, relax that collarbone and just get yourself ready to go. Let's take the arms out to the side slightly, legs slightly together, breathing out, take the legs to one side, breathe in and bring them up and take it the other way. And again, let's do one more each side. So just taking it away, trying to keep the shoulders on the floor so you just come back to the center. And if you've got the opportunity to just do this outside in the garden, then it's really, really nice. Bring your hands down by your side and we'll take it into a pelvic tilt. So lower back into the mat, just keep that on the floor, but just lift the bottom, squeeze the glutes and back down into a neutral position. Brilliant. So again, we are just warming up or mobilizing that lower back. We'll do two more. And again, brilliant. And try and keep the collarbone nice and open. Last one, excellent, okay. So from here, where you're in your neutral, we're gonna bring one leg up bent and we're gonna bring the other leg bent. You can stay here, you can lengthen those arms off the floor for me. And if you want to, you can curl up, but I still want you to keep your legs bent. So we're gonna breathe in for a count of five and breathe out for a count of five. So keep those armpits lowered, keep lengthening through that spine and stay in that neutral position. Brilliant, and again, breathing in and breathe out. Now you've got to remember I'm a Pilates teacher and I cannot count. And again, lovely, keep it going. From here I want you to take, or you can keep your legs where they are, take them up in the air, breathing in and breathe out. Good, keep those armpits lowered, keep that collarbone nice and open. And again, keep that breathing going, breathing in for five and breathe out for five good i hope you're enjoying this it's very hot here good i'm going to take the legs to the floor if you can't do this just take them down nicely maintain that neutral and work through that center let me shuffle up my mat a bit good from here breathing in breathe out come just come up and take it forward now if you can't get up from the floor that's absolutely fine just bring yourself up and just go to where you know you can squeeze those inner thighs send those legs away from you again you don't have to go to the floor and again, breathing out, start to breathe. Keep that out breath going as you bring it forward into your spine stretch. Lovely, pulling back through that center. Sit up tall, we'll do two more. Squeeze the glutes, send those legs away, inner thighs, working through that center as you take it back. So we breathe in to start, breathe out. Get those armpits lower to so try not to use the shoulders or throw yourself forward to get up. If you're doing that, don't go to the floor, just take it to where you can lovely and the last one up breathing out as you come up so you've got to really use that center take it forward one last time for me a really nice stretch good i'm going to bend my legs but you can keep them strong uh, straight if you want i'm going to take my hands behind my head sit up nice and tall breathing in push your head into your hands and breathe out and twist bringing it back to the center lowering those armpits if they're rising up taking it the other way Excellent, good. Bring it back to the center. Keep lengthening. Breathing out as you come round. Breathe in as you come back. And then take it the other way. Don't forget that breath. Good, let's do one more. Again, a movement we don't do enough. And if you've been sitting around on holiday, this is actually a really nice one to do. And relax. Brilliant, good. From there, let's take it into rolling back. So bring those heels towards you, look down at your tummies, lift those feet off the floor and just keep tilting to a point where you think you can just about hold it. Keep looking at the tummy, breathing in, breathing out. Oh, I'm not on very level ground. Breathing in, breathing out. Keep it going. What a lot of people do is they, when they roll back, they tend to look up at the sky or the ceiling and that's when you find it hard to come back up because you've straightened your back up. Let's do two more. I'm quite enjoying this now I've got my groove last one keep looking down breathe in breathe out now if you can hold it here lengthen one leg and take it down if you need to put your legs down 
then that up your head down sorry that's fine so we take it from here and here breathing in breathing out so we're doing the one leg stretch good and again let's do two more two and one lovely from there take it into double leg stretch we're going to lengthen those legs take the arms behind and back now again you can do this with your head down that's absolutely fine and you can take your arms up a little or your legs up a little bit higher that's fine too good keep that going let's do two more really squeeze those inner thighs together take those heels together if you can last one brilliant good bring those legs to your chest have a stretch from there we're going to take it onto our sides we're going to take it into the side kick so we're lengthening out making sure you can just see your toes your hips are on top of each other and breastbone pubic bone is in line let's turn that top hip out so the toes point into the ceiling and we're going to take it up and down and we'll just do that four times really draw up through the center remember this one is about balance last one good and then we're going to take it forward so we're going to really challenge that balance if you need to put your hand here do use that glute as you take it back good squeeze the glute and make sure you're working through that center and two more lovely good and last one brilliant well done good from there we're going to roll onto our fronts and we're going to take it into swan down again if you've been sitting for long periods because you've been on the beach or just on the, the uh, sun lounger or whatever elbows into the side lengthen through the spine lower those armpits and come up breathing out as you do and just come to where you can squeezing those glutes bringing those elbows back in and coming back down lovely good lengthen lower those armpits bring it up really working through that center and two more so again with these you can do more if you want to you can pause me and do a couple of more just if you want to do a slightly longer workout last one brilliant good really nice excellent and then come back on your heels and have a quick stretch so taking the nose towards the knees lengthening through that spine lengthening those arms good and then we take it the other way so i'm just going to turn so i'm facing you we're going to lie down on your side let me just move that around good and we're going to make sure our hips are on top of each other as we turn the uh, top hip out so we're going to come up and down breathing out breathing in two more try and keep the shoulders nice and relaxed if you've got your hand there that's absolutely fine but don't push too much down taking it forward take it back use that glute use that center take it back as far as you can remember you're doing your balance here good two more lovely excellent and last one well done good really hope you enjoyed that little quick routine something to do while you're away even if you've been on the beach all day or first thing in the morning to get you up and going if you want to see more like this make sure you comment below and subscribe to my YouTube channel. See you next time.